Oh, jam! Hello again, and welcome back to Let the Wookie Win. I'm Chewie, and as you can tell, we're playing Hearthstone. We're still working our way through the Blackwing Lair. Got it right this time. It's amazing what happens when you read the freaking title. And I have no idea. Ooh, 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 we got worms. Oh, God. Eh. I have no idea who this is, but we are going to beat the crap out of them, in theory. So let's see. Cro-Magus is one of my greatest achievements. Look at him. I don't wanna. He's got two head. He's a two-headed dragon. And anyone that's ever played against a two-headed dragon in Magic knows that that's terrifying. Nefarian has been busy experimenting. Yikes! It actually says yikes. Look at this. Look at this. What's his hero power? Zero Brood Affliction. At the end of your turn, add a Brood Affliction card to your owner's to your opponent's hand. So he's gonna be giving us a Brood Affliction card every turn. I don't I don't know what that is. Let's find out. So at the end of every turn we get one card. Huh. I never know, if the hero power is so vague, I never know what to play. I'm really sick of the face Hunter deck, but I swear it's, the, it's a good idea. Alright, just to mix it up, I'm going to try the Combolicious Warrior deck. This has the Raging Worgen, the Grim Patron, and lots of ways to draw cards and uh, Whirlwinds and Death Spite and all that stuff. So I'm going to try it. Just because it's fun, and I have no idea what to expect, and I don't care if we lose, because we already lost. Yeah. Hey, I, I killed a corrupt good guy last time. Oh, now I'm sad. Not really. I'm a heartless bastard. I didn't care. I went, eh, for a second. Garrosh versus Cro-Magus! <laughs> Hi, Tim. Victory or death. Yeah. Okay. Throw back the War Song Commander. Keep the Fiery War X. We'll throw back the Battle Rage and hope to get some gas. Some meat. Some execute and whirlwind. That only sort of helps. Oh, well. Let's see what a Brute Affliction card is. In a minute. Your turn. I gave him two heads because I figured, hey. <laughs> Double the biting. All right, what is what is this? While this is in your hand, restore two health to your opponent at the start of your turn. I see now. Oh, that's messed up. And in order to get out of my hand, I have to use a mana. Oh, that's a jerk move. Okay, so I don't care if he restores two health now, so I'm just going to play my War Axe and tell him to go. Played a Druid card first. What was it? Claw, yeah. Now what's he pointing out? A Blackwing Technician complete with... Hey! What was that? While this is in your hand, take one damage at the start of your turn. Oh, you cheeky bastard. Um, hmm. Wow, this is messed up. Okay. So what are the options here? I can cast this to get out of my hand and armor up. I can taskmaster and execute the technician. I really want to hold on to that taskmaster for the raging worgen if at all possible. Okay, so I think I'll... <sighs> this is ridiculous. Um, I'm not gonna whirlwind, all right. I should hit? Should I hit this? Yeah. Yeah. So I'll hit this. Execute it. 
and then cast both of these while I have a chance. I infused him with the powers of all the dragon flights. He's perfect. Oh, is he now? While this is in your hand, Chromagus' spells cost one less. <sighs> well, negative Ghost Rider. Alright, so let's... Let's go ahead and kill it. Armor up. Say go. My work is paramount. Another one? Come on, man. What is this? Bronze is, while well, it's in your hand, his minions cost one less. Nice. Oh, I don't want to do that, but I'm going to. Okay, we're going to play the Worgen. We're going to poke it with a Taskmaster. And we're going to hope that he kills it instead of hitting us in the face, because we're going to start dying here soon. And then I have hiccups. Excuse me. Yes, okay. When I... While this is in your hand, whenever Chromagus draws a card, he gets another copy of it. Oh. Oh, and there's the Warsong Commander we needed last turn. Ugh. Okay. Okay, we're gonna kill this. As dumb as this probably is. Yeah, this is the wrong deck to play here, and I apologize. Let's go ahead and get rid of it. I'm not trying to attack, I'm trying to get rid of this crap. Of course it's a Twilight Drake. Why wouldn't it be a Twilight Drake? Like to play with fire? Can't say as I do. Blue spells cost one less. Can I get it? No. Get out of my hand. Alright, remember this is a combo deck. We're not, we're just trying to survive until we win. That's the goal. So... Kill this. Do I kill this? Nah. Give me something good. My other beasts. What is this? When your opponent casts a spell, gain plus two plus two. Holy crap. Oh, I forgot to attack first. Damn it. Rookie mistake. Right, well, hopefully that'll make him trade there and leave us alone. Yeah, I just... I just cast the wrong spell. Or picked the wrong deck, rather. That was my bad. Oh no, I didn't think about that. I meant to hit him first. Damn it. Yeah, we lose. Yeah, that was just stupid. Okay, yeah, let's start over and be serious this time. My bad. That was my bad. But what do I play there? Hmm. Screw it. I'm going aggro again. It seems to be the only one that makes any sense. Rexa versus Chromagus. Get into it, keeper. Shut your face. Let the hunt. Hell yeah, a bunch of three drops. That was actually awful. Give me some cheap stuff. It'll be like four and five drops now. I don't even have four and five drops in the deck. One, two, three. That's not bad. I'll take it. Left for no. I 
gave him two heads because I figured, hey, double the biting. Shut up, you Sarkon Ball looking jerk. Alright, which one is this? Restore to hell. Okay. Well, that's clearly gotta go. Because aggro. Get in there, fight, so now let's dragon. get in there for four. Suck it! Give me that big hug. Yeah. I love you so much, I'm gonna drain your pool of lava. Oh, you're going face two? Dude, I hate to break it to you, you're gonna lose that fight. Okay, now we play the Glaive Zooka to make something bigger. Awesome. Uh, I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and kill this. And the only reason to do that is so I can get rid of these without screwing myself. Yeah. I infused him with the powers of all the dragon flights. He's perfect. Now you do sound like Sarkon Bull. Dude, you need you need to chill, okay? Alright, so we're gonna screw it. We are going all out here. Sever my wrath! Not a single damn was given. Oh, I almost forgot to attack with my hasty guy. Uh, charge guy. That would have been stupid. Why do I even try to play against other decks? That's what I want to... Well, you idiot. I really worry about the AI sometimes. Wait. What is this? His minions cost one less. Mm. Let's just assume for a minute that I'm okay with that for one turn. Because I'm about to hit him for six. Blah. Blah. Okay. So he's at seven. If I can... Oh, wow. Okay. So he's dead, right? Three, four, five, six, seven, yeah. Three. Yeah, it's a bite, get it? Oh, this is actually three more. Bye bye bang. You know I'm gonna cast this too just to make him extra big. And then I'm gonna kill you. Yeah. Actually, Chromagus was my weakest minion. Were you impressed with yourself? I thought he was perfect. He's so dreamy. Shut up, Nefarian. Oh, dude, I got the Hungry Dragon. Okay, so, for four mana, he's a five, six dragon. His battle cry, as you saw when he played him earlier, summon a random one-cost minion for your opponent. Now, I think this thing's awesome, because I ran through all the one-drops, and not very many of them were bad enough to warrant not getting a 5-6 for 4. They, they just weren't. So, I love this guy. I will be playing him with my Dragon Consort in my dragon -y Paladin deck once I get that put together. Because, awesome. Whether this ends up being competitive, I have no idea. But a 5-6 for 4 is really good. And let's say one of the one drop, like the worst one drops you could get for your opponent are like the two ones. So that means, let's say you give them a, a 2-1, you pass the turn, and they run it into this. Well, now it's a 5-4 four for 4, which was a lost Tall Strider, which isn't great. But, uh, with the dragon synergies and whatnot, I think it might be worth it. I'm going to give it a shot and see if I'm impressed or not. But you, they won't always get the 2-1.
And yeah, I don't know what else to say. I don't have a list of the one drops in front of me or else I would rattle through them real quick. But most of them, as I said, are just not bad enough to be a real drawback, I don't think. So I'm really happy I have this guy now. I'm going to put him in some decks. Yeah. Love it. Hey, that's Nefarian. Okay, I didn't think we'd be fighting the ferry until next week. Huh. I guess we'll figure that out on the next episode. So, like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you want to know exactly when new videos go public. If you want to get videos 24 hours early and podcasts 36 to 48 hours early then you can go to Patreon and support me there. Or if you just want to give a few bucks, every little bit helps. I really appreciate it. And uh, let me know how you beat Chromagus. Like I said, I always want to know what other strategies worked. Obviously, the Combo Warrior didn't work so much, but the kill him quick before anything happens worked beautifully. So that's that. Thank you all very much for watching, and uh, go play some Hearthstone. Oh, so apparently he was just a nice happy red dragon and then they tormented him and made him and now he's a lunatic and now to kill us all. It's like the born identity but with giant scales and it breeds fire. Although the born identity was different. <laughs> I keep together. Well, Lee Loxodon. Now that is really an elephant See, dude. That's the elephant dude. Yeah, isn't he cute? I mean, he is really big. He's going on a long journey. See that truck? <laughs> That was the sound of a face palm, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>